Clip on the rug, look like a rule. All right, so I'm back, and before the video start, it's greatly appreciated. But you want to like, so please like, comment, and subscribe. And so this video, Jonathan, damn it, got the whole cast in shambles. Like he. <laughs> He said one thing, everyone's in an uproar. The kind of he's on live, and he said everyone in the house was attention seeking and scary. Really? But all of them be attention seeking, and I feel like everybody in the house was scary. Like, they didn't know what they wanted, who, like, they didn't even know who they was. They said. Personally, I don't really know about attention seeking because if you think about it, all of them are on the show to get attention, right? Now, scary? Who was really scary? I don't. Who was scary? I'm not gonna lie. I did see some some iffy situations, like when when they had their mind set up, and then Jonathan, you know, his his mind was on the opposite of what they was thinking, but they just all went with Jonathan. I, that I don't. If you want to call that scary, I guess so, cause I don't know. The first comment I seen was Big Lou, and he said, "Girl, who? Well, you, cause technically he said everybody, and you fall into everybody, so he talking about you too. But I don't think Big Lou was scary, even though Ara said he was scared of uh." Adonis, I didn't, mm, ain't really give scary to me. But Adonis, he commented too. He said, I'm not scary at all, period. I'm just a cool dude. I won't initially start a fight unless we got some type of beef or I know you want to take it there. I might just be like, what's up? Some of the cast completely changed their whole personality, even the way they speak. When the cameras came on and some of the altercations that could have happened on the show, I actually avoided because I would have looked like a bully fighting certain castmates. I know I'm stronger than and bigger than. Well, who are you talking about? Because damn near the whole cast was some big-ass niggas. Like, they are huge. They, and, <laughs> only people that was shorter than him is Ara, probably. And bigger than is uh probably Ara, once again. But Ara could fight. He not scared anyway. Um, What's the what's the nigga with the dreads? What's his name? Carry on. He looks skinny. And Big Lou, he was smaller, too. So, I guess, is that the people you're talking about? Oh, and Rail. Rally, Rally. But I don't think Rally was scared, either. Like how, watching back, I could see that room scene was a way to get me and Carry On to bump heads. Now, if I'm being honest, Adonis versus Carry On, come on, Adonis is beating that man ass. Like, it, well, well, no, 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 I think Adonis is winning that one. Jonathan, he responded to Adonis and he said, all y'all changed up because you was doing none of that in the house and you know that. You was popping all that stuff in confessionals and in the house, you was quiet like a like a scared dog. But production was telling you what to say and who not to intervene with. And you know damn well, if they was following me, you was behind me way more trying to be in my face every second. I was ignoring you the whole time. So stop saying everyone was following me. Now, let's not lie, right? A lot of people do be saying they scared of Jonathan, Jonathan the ringleader, especially after uh, JB, it was a couple people that wanted Ara out the house. Jonathan said he didn't want Ara out the house and all their minds just flipped. That's, yeah, because that was kind of weird. Like, how y'all, how y'all opinion changed that fast? Ara, he commented as well. So Ara said, the ones that was scary was the people that came in the house as a group. I hated being around this cast and after a certain point, I checked out and was just ready to go. Who wants to be around a bunch of follow the leader type of dudes all day long? Made me want to throw up. Only other person with their own mind was my brother Adonis. Oh, all right, are you sure? Because Jonathan just said Adonis was following him all around the house and he was ignoring him. Then I will say, for one, I don't think Ara is scary. And I don't think he was a follow the leader type of person. Ara definitely had his own mindset and his own opinion when he came to things, even if it was against the whole house. But Jonathan responded to Ara as well. Jonathan said, Ara, right, if they was followers, y'all was definitely followers too. Adonis was way up my ass and the whole time you was having weed attacks. What 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 is a weed attack? Hold on. Weed attacks or anything I genuinely didn't want to be around none of y'all, but I settled to do it. And Adonis don't got a mind when he came in, he wouldn't have been trying to be friendly. If I didn't make them fight, all y'all ass would have been having the best brotherhood. When it came to that situation, Jonathan also said, with the exception of three. Now who is the three? Who is the three? <laughs> because if you think about it, a lot of people were saying JB. JB and Prince and someone else, I think, that wanted Ara out the house and you said you didn't want... Like, they was the main people they were saying following you. Prince said, thank God Jonathan has spoken. Nigga, I stayed to myself all season. I smoked everyone out and argued with my girl uh, all season. I smoked Ara out every day and he was having weed attacks. What, the, what is a weed attack? Jonathan is right. If it wasn't for him instigating and Chef D doing the most, it would have been a brotherhood. Ara lonely on the show. He did weirdo stuff too, had a pick me attitude, and literally talked bad about everyone in the hotel before we all loaded up to the first house. I don't know why he called the niggas crying when he left the football game because men started tackling him. Um, he didn't want to fight or box in the coming episodes. He lived in his room and never came out until it was time to film. But we scary and followers, man. I wish and hope they pray. 
I wish, hope, and pray next season, whether I'm on it or not. They Without me being biased, because me personally, I love Ara, and I don't really like how he got treated on the show. But Ara said this. Ara said he stayed in the room. Uh, he we and we know Ara isolated himself, but it's like y'all was treating him a little crazy. Y'all was treating him like he didn't belong there. Am I tripping? Am I? That's literally the reason why Ara what the second fan favorite, if not the first. Well, I'm pretty sure Orlando's the first, but Ara got Ara got some of the most positive feedback besides Orlando. But I will say that could be the bias in me talking. I don't really think so, but it could be. Doubt it. Doubt it. They also said never said scared of me. They were scared to be themselves. Ara was himself a little. Adonis was not being himself. That's it for this video. This whole topic got to be in two videos because I don't know how I'm going to fit all this in one title. So this is part one and part two is going to be up shortly after. But if you found this video interesting, and I hope you did, please like, comment, subscribe, share, turn your post notifications on. Thank you.